Greetings everyone and thank you so much for joining me. I am Jay and today I have for you a haul. It's small but exciting, at least for me because these candles I didn't expect to get until much later. If they aren't already in your store, they should be there by the end of the month. So if you're interested in any of them, keep your eye out. First up, the much anticipated return of the Three Wick Cider Lane. This one smells exactly like I remember Cider Lane smelling. If you haven't smelt Cider Lane, but you've smelt Caramel Apple, this is along the same thought process. It's not exactly the same, but if you like Caramel Apple, chances are you're gonna like this too. Strong thrower, it's always performed well for me, so. It comes in this coppery leaf jar with a copper lid. Pretty cute, I can't complain too much. It's better than a weird quote thing on it. Next up we have Gather. The scent notes on this are bourbon glazed apples, maple sugar, and creamy vanilla. This one has a very strong top note of bourbon apple. I typically don't like alcohol type scents because they just don't appeal to me. But this one had enough of the other notes where I was kind of intrigued by it. I really, I want to know if this is going to kick up the alcohol note as it burns or if it's going to bring it down. I really hope that it tones down, but I have a feeling it might kick up. Anyways, the jar on this is gold leaves with obviously orange wax and a copper lid. Pretty cute. Next up we have Cranberry Woods. This one is rumored to be different than last year's Cranberry Woods and I don't have that one in front of me. I will do a side by side, but for now, if memory serves me right, this one smells a little bit spicier than last year's. This one comes with a copper lid and sort of like a tree bark, a shiny gold tree bark pattern. Yeah, very, it's like thought was definitely put into this though. Again, better than a random quote that has nothing to do with fall. Anyways, next up, cinnamon bark. This one's pretty basic. It smells like cinnamon, clove, and vanilla. And again, we have a tree bark pattern, this time going the other way. Shiny gold with a brown background. So that is cinnamon bark. They didn't have any of the other candles in this collection. And I'm pretty sure they're gonna have more in this collection. They, they just had these two. I'm hoping, okay. A little bit, side note here. I'm hoping that they bring back apple pie and pumpkin pie in this or a different collection sometime soon because I miss those candles. Now, I know some people were saying that their apple pie didn't throw very well, but mine always threw fine for me, so. Let's hope that if they bring it back, everybody has a good experience. Anyways, next up, I got the hard to come by. See, I got two hard to come bys. Pumpkin peanut brittle and blueberry maple pancakes. This one is always sold out or in, what's it? After they sell out, it's sold out for a while. And yeah, so I got the last one. Pretty excited about that. This one, another hard to get hold of one, pumpkin peanut brittle. They had a few of these though, so I just got one and saved the rest for somebody else. Sorry about that guys, I got cut off. My battery's super, super low, but yeah, that's all the candles I got today. If you have any experience burning any sort of boozy or bourbony scented candles, let me know what the scent does because I'm interested to hear other people's experiences with them. Thank you for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye.